categorize them as being hypertension? Uh, not, in just one, not in one reading unless the patient has had a prior diagnosis of hypertension. Um, and also in the context uh, of that, uh, that patient. You know, we mistake blood pressures and they, when the patient has been arrested, they're not smoking or having had anything to eat or you know, any caffeine-containing substances. Because once you've made the diagnosis of hypertension, you actually now pronounce this on the patient for the rest of their life. So it's important to make the diagnosis accurately. Um, so random readings, you know, elevated pressures, like we said, can be caused by any argument, uh, whether it be f over football or which team you support or anything else, any other grass that you might have. Yeah. Um, other conditions such as anemia, uh, thyroid disorders, uh, taking off uh, psychoactive uh, substances, and including nicotine as well, will also elevate your, your blood pressure. And that is not hypertension. Hypertension is a, 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 a renovascular and humeral disease. Uh, it's not uh, just random blood pressures. Blood, blood pressures are used to help us diagnose it as well as to decide on how well we've actually achieved blood pressure control in, when treating hypertension. So is blood pressure the force that the blood moves in our circulatory system where it hits the arterial walls. Is that, is that the pressure that's being measured or monitored when you do a blood pressure? Reading? Roughly speaking, yes, that it is. Yes. Yeah. And it's got a it's systolic and diastolic. diastolic. So yeah. what's the difference? I mean, obviously there's top number and bottom number, right? Uh, could you just define as to you know, what those numbers mean? So the systolic reading is, is the reading that we first hear the, uh, the sounds of the pulse when the, we reduce the cuff and the, uh, the blood pressure, the, sorry, the cuff pressure, and the, diast uh, the diastolic is when we hear the full pulse uh, again. So systolic occlusion of the pulse and diastolic is when you hear it again. So we call those Karotkov uh, sounds. And that is the very um, classical way of, uh, of measuring blood pressure. We have other ways of measuring it as well. We use automated machines, we use ambulatory machines, and then, of course, invasive monitoring in certain